Hi everyone, welcome to Mental Health for the Digital Generation once again. I'm Kristen. Now, when you have anxiety and depression, which I've had before and it's horrible, how much is the focus on you all the time? How do I feel? Is it going to go away? When will this go away? How do I feel now? Is it any better than before? Um, will I ever get through this? These are thoughts that go through your head constantly. And what I want to share in this video is what I think could be a really helpful tool in getting yourself out of it. Now it's normal to be so focused on you when you're going through this because it's almost impossible to think of anything else. I know that I was there and whilst I could see that life was going on around me, it was so hard to to see that because all I could focus on was how bad I felt. Have any of you had thoughts going through your mind just constantly, will I get out of this, how do I feel now, it's so bad, all that sort of stuff. If you've had these thoughts, they're completely normal. And what I think you need to do is try your hardest to take the focus off you as hard as it is and you do something for somebody else. I'm particularly passionate about animal rights, so that's where my heart is most. So for example, if you feel that way too, you could go and volunteer at a animal shelter just one day a week or look into it at least. Just go online and see what you can do for the animals if you're you know, particularly drawn to helping children. Um, there are children's hospitals you could go help out at. Just something, some sort of volunteer work I think is extremely powerful because for a couple of reasons. Well, you're taking the focus off you, you're helping somebody else, and we need this as humans. We need to feel like we're contributing. If we don't feel like we're doing anything, that's when we can feel more depressed and more um you know, your self-worth is diminished. Uh, you could also volunteer at a soup kitchen or a mental health organization since you've been there and you know what it's like. Um, volunteer work is so extremely powerful. I would recommend anybody who's going through a rut right now and you just can't seem to take the focus off you, go and help somebody else. Alternatively, if you're, you know, not up to doing volunteer work at this stage, you could go and help a friend. You could call a friend who you know is having a rough time. Do something nice for someone. Just that small act of kindness, like I said before, can take the focus off you and how bad you're feeling and give you a sense of purpose, especially if you're feeling particularly bad about yourself, which is really common when we're going through depression, anxiety. A lot of thoughts um, consume you like, I'm not good enough. Sorry, that's the dog. Um, say shut. <laughs> and yeah, and this can consume you. So, you know, what better way to feel better about yourself than to know you're contributing and helping other people? I'm Kristen, uh, this is Mental Health for the Digital Generation, and I'll see you next time.